Hey everyone, welcome back to Pseudotech, and today I'm going to be doing a quick video to show you how to install an ISO file onto an external drive, such as a USB drive. This is super helpful if you want to download something such as a Linux operating system and put it onto a USB drive so that you can install it on one of your other computers. I'm going to be demonstrating this with Debian, and you can see I'm going to the website and downloading the correct ISO file for the correct architecture that I'm going to be using it on. But this is the same process for really any kind of install for any kind of disk image. So just grab your disk image and then let's get right to it. You're also going to want to download Rufus, which makes it super simple to both format your USB drive and put the installer onto it. It's pretty much the best utility that I've found and a lot of people use it. So go ahead to the website in the description down below where you can download it. Once both of those files are downloaded, go ahead and double click the Rufus file. This isn't actually an installer, it's just a standalone program which makes it super simple. If you have one USB drive already plugged in, it should recognize it and it should get the defaults for it. You want an MBR partition scheme for both BIOS and UEFI. You can choose the file system, but I would recommend FAT32 just because it works with the most operating systems. And then finally, you can click the little disk icon at the bottom to choose your installer. If it's an ISO image, it should show that in the drop down menu. If it doesn't, change it to ISO image or whatever it is to reflect the correct kind of file that you're installing on the USB drive. Then you can go ahead and click start and it'll start installing it onto the drive. Keep in mind that this will wipe the contents of your drive, so hopefully you don't have anything important on there. If you do, just back it up and then you should be good to go. This usually takes about 5 to 10 minutes depending on which ISO you're putting onto the drive, so just wait it out and when it's done there will be a little button that says close and you can click on that to exit out of Rufus. And that's it! You've successfully installed an operating system installer onto your USB drive. So boot it up on your computer and you should be able to follow the instructions on screen to get you up and running. If you need some help with that, I've got a couple of videos coming out on my channel very soon about how you can do that with a couple different operating systems, including Debian, Ubuntu, and OpenSUSE. So make sure to subscribe so that you can check those out as soon as they come out. Anyway, thank you for watching and I will see you in the next video.